Medicaid Gen 62, Medicaid Gen 63, Medicaid Gen 66, Medicare 61, Battalion 1615, respond on a residential flyer. 1592 Schaefer, 5092 Schaefer, Cross of Central, Map Page TC2, Fire Command 1, Tech 1. This tragedy could have been avoided with a working smoke detector. Hi, I'm Engineer Arnie Clement with the Chino Valley Fire District, and I'm here to talk to you today about life-saving tools. As firefighters, we work with life-saving tools every day. At home, one of the most important life-saving tools you have is a working smoke detector. This tool may someday save your life. I'm here to talk to you about where this life-saving tool should be in your home. A working smoke detector should be properly installed on every level of your home, outside sleeping areas, and in hallways. Once you've installed those smoke detectors, be sure to check the batteries once a month. Now I'm going to talk about how we test our smoke detector's batteries, but first, we recommend that you change your smoke detector's batteries every time you change your clocks for daylight savings or any time that you hear the smoke detector chirping and we recommend that you never use your smoke detector's batteries for anything else. Also, replace the smoke detector according to the manufacturer's guidelines. I'm going to use this broom handle to test the smoke detector's batteries. And that's what it should sound like if it's working properly. For more information on the proper use and installation of smoke detectors, contact the Chino Valley Fire District or visit our website. Together, we are partners in safety.